it's definitely the fastest track that we've ever driven in a Formula D circuit. Um, the entry is over 100 miles per hour. I mean, I'm hitting consistently like 101, 103. Daigo put through down like a 107 yesterday. So it's definitely like the fastest track in uh, the, se the season. Um, but it's a lot of fun. It's, you know, you have this fast entry and then you go up over this little hill. And it's kind of blind and you flick it back into this long sweeper. It's, it's kind of technical in that you really need to hit your marks to throw down a good run. If you don't hit any of your marks, it's really gonna throw you off for the rest of the run. So it's really key on being like super precise with the car placement and you're going so fast. So it's pretty technical. I'm having a fantastic event, blasting through the ladder, getting ready to line up for the final four, and uh, Ian comes on the radio. He's like, hey, Pat just protested you. I'm like, protested me for what? When he chased me, he was right with me. When I chased him, he was slow. I was waiting for him everywhere. And in drifting, you either pick up the throttle and go, which would mean hitting him, or you lift, wait for him, and then go and you know rather than hit him i waited we straightened a little bit i still haven't seen the video but uh you know it's uh, a really frustrating thing you know we got pulled out of competition it is what it is i'm definitely bummed out you know we worked really hard to be here qualified first this was our opportunity to to really step up and get some points back and, and still chase the championship and uh you know we did earn some points and uh aside from that you know I'm happy with how I did behind the wheel. I'm happy with how my team performed. And uh, unfortunately, we're not standing on the podium spraying champagne, and we're kind of pissed off. So it is what it is. <laughs>